Hi. Good evening. Good evening. Hello. How is it going? How are you? How are you? How are you? Okay, well, welcome. We have three people today. Good. Okay, let me share the screen. Please. Okay, here we go. Well, I hope this is the right one. It is. Yes, it is. Okay. Well, welcome. Today is our class number 10. And these are the objectives for today's class. To review the use of some, any, counting, non count nouns for food. And describe food people have in different countries. For instance, American food, Mexican food, so different type of food, right? Okay. Let me just move. Before, yes, before we go to that part, I'm going to, give me one second. Yes, I'm going to share a link for you to practice the use of some and any. I'm going to send you the link in WhatsApp, in your WhatsApp group, so that you can practice the use of some and any. Give me one second, please. I just need to get to the link. Yes, it would be this one. Let me see. Mm -hmm. Here we go. Okay, this is what you're going to do. You are going to access and practice the exercises, okay? If you have any questions, just ask me. If you have any doubts, if you need any help, please. You may ask. Okay, are you doing the exercise? Did you get to the website? Yes. Okay. All right, did you get it? Did you get to the exercises? Was it possible? All right. Well, actually, you can compare your answers. This is what we're going to do. Yes, you can compare your answers with your partners. Mm -hmm. Let's see. One second, please.
Hi. Hi, good evening. Good evening. Did you get the exercises from the link I share with you? Uh, yes. Uh, going to the, to the class and don't know what we do. Okay, in, in your WhatsApp group, I posted a link. Okay. Okay, you access to that link and practice with the exercises for some or any. Okay. All right. Good. And then we're going to see the answers, okay? Hi, are you ready? Hello, are you ready? Hello, about some or any. Where are the link? In this chat? In the Zoom? WhatsApp group. Ah, yes. okay. And, my, uh, and we have, I have 10 off my minutes. cell phone. Yes, me too. The number one. Hello, hello. Did you get the link that I share on WhatsApp? Did you get it? Are you practicing with those exercises? Hi. Okay, in Spanish. Yo mandé un link en su grupo de WhatsApp. Accesan a él y realizan los ejercicios que ahí les dan, please. Es para hacer repaso de el uso de some and any. Yes? Hey, good evening. How are you? Okay, I turn on my cell phone. Uh, I find a link. Mm -hmm. And this is a quiz. Mm -hmm. Ah, okay, it is a quiz. Yes, it has 15 uh, questions. That's we right. Choose about a, any, or some for each one. Right, exactly. Oops. Yeah. 
¿Por qué no encuentro nada? Eh, ahorita, a ver, quiero ver. Okay, the quiz I'm going from to number five. Uh, we need to buy some flour. This is the five. The six is there aren't a, any cucumbers in the salad. Can you repeat? Seven, do we need? And um, this is any, any bread. Eight, there is, uh, there is uh, a sauce in the fridge. Nine, there is um, any. No, some, this is wrong. <laughs> so I finished the first, but I have nine correct and six. <clears throat> <laughs> the 11, uh, what is the 11, the, the request? The 11. 11. I, uh, I reset the the quiz. <laughs> ah, okay. I got the search. No lo tengo. No sé cómo lo no se lo puedo compartir. Este. Hello. El link para accesar el quiz está en el grupo de WhatsApp. No, es que le comentaba yo a Henry que yo creo que no estoy en ese grupo de WhatsApp porque estaba buscando ahorita y los últimos mensajes que tengo fueron del día que se iniciaron las clases. Que really? me enviaron. Ajá, ajá. All right. Entonces estaba intentando él enviarme el link para unirme a ese grupo, pero no uh -huh. encontró cómo mandarme. ¿Aquí en este chat? ¿En el chat de Zoom? Ajá. Uh -huh. Mm -hmm. Wait a minute. Melissa, right? Mm -hmm. Okay. Mm -hmm. Here we go. Perdón? Give me one second, please. Ah, okay. Ahí está. You've got it? Yes. Sí, sí, el quiz, sí, ya lo tengo. All right, Gracias. perfect. No problem. Hey, Mr. Aguirre, did you get the link? Uh, yes, yes, teacher, I got, I got. You got it. All right, perfect. Yeah. Did you complete it? No. Not yet. <laughs> Not yet because I barely just connect. I know. I noticed. I had problem at work with my connection because my computer. <sighs> That's terrible. Yeah, but. Do I it. Think. Yeah, do it right now. No problem. Relax. Take it easy. Can you if you have the 
a little bit time to explain me. Oh, sure. It's just a quiz to review the use of some, any. A, of course, we're going to use um, counts and non counts, right? With count okay. nouns, we use plural lemons, five lemons, three apples. And with non counts, we usually use some, some sugar, some flour, some milk, right? And with countables, singular, we can use a or an, an apple, a melon, yes, a sandwich. We usually use those um, determiners as well. That is, that is all you have to do. Okay, thanks. Just do it. <laughs> Just do it. <laughs> Automatically, no problem. We need we start again. Just start it again. All right. Yeah. It's all right. We need to buy some. some. Okay, were you able to finish or not yet? <laughs> I know, it's okay, no problem. All right. Yes, now we are all back. Yes, you had some time to complete those sentences. They were not really challenging, but let's just have a look. Probably you can still see your quiz. And the number one was, I don't have an, any, or some cereal. Mm -hmm. Which is the correct one. Do you remember? I don't have an, any, or some cereal. What is the correct word that you have to choose? Don't remember? Any. Any, exactly. I don't have any cereal. Number two. I don't need to buy some, an, or any milk some i don't need to buy some milk any any milk exactly negative right there is any some or a butter in the fridge mm -hmm. some. some definitely there is some butter in the fridge right okay we need to buy a any or some flour? Uh -huh. any. We need to buy a, some, or any flour. Any. any flour? We need to buy any flour. Affirmative. Mm -hmm. 
We need to buy some flour. Some flour, okay? It's not countable. There are a, any, or some oranges in my paper bag. Some. Some oranges, exactly. Okay. Let's buy any, some, or a, a strawberries. Some. Some strawberries, exactly. Okay. Is there some, any, or a sugar in your tea? Any. Is there any sugar in your tea? Exactly. Okay. Are there and some or any donuts in your lunchbox? Any. Any. any because of the question right are there any donuts in your lunchbox all right are there any some or a pair in the box any are there any pairs right in your box there is a and or any sausage in the fridge? A. A. <laughs> there is a sausage in the fridge. That's right. All right. Do we have any, some, or a ah, cheese? <laughs> Do we have? Any? Any cheese. Do we have any cheese? Right. Okay. Do we need some, any, or an bread? Any. Do we need any bread? That's right. Okay. There is a, any, or some tomato in the box. There is a tomato in the box. That's right. And the last one, there aren't an, any, or some cucumbers in the salad. Any. There aren't any cucumbers in the salad. Ooh. Vaya. Just curiosity. Cuando tomaron el quiz, ¿cuántas correctas le salieron? How many did you get correct? Six. Six? Yes. Six, uh -huh. five, four, three, eleven, twelve. Five. Five. No, nine. Nine, all right. Nine. Nine. Twelve, that's nice. Mr. Romero is on fire. Miss Melissa, fourteen. That's great. Thirteen, Mr. Cassett. ¿Y por qué están tan callados? I just wonder. <laughs> I just wonder, six for Mr. Lopez. All right, don't be quiet. Be talkative. Yes, you gave the answers. All right, perfect. So that is a signal that we need to practice a lot. A lot, a lot, a lot. Okay, let's see. One side. I forget. All right, I think it is one. Yes, for the ones that just joined. Yeah, that was just part of the review, okay? Yesterday class, we introduced the use of some and any for count and non-count nouns for food. All right, today, definitely, we keep talking about food. Hold on. And we're going to be learning a little bit about the different type of food depending of the countries of course this uh, image shows a little bit of the customs of eating for three different countries for breakfast okay what do you have for breakfast in the u.s in japan and mexico of course you can include el salvador here three pupusas and a cup of chocolate <laughs> okay or two eggs 
beans, fried bananas, and a cup of coffee, right? So what do you have? What do you usually have for breakfast? In the US, people usually have eggs, bacon, toast with butter, orange juice, coffee, jam or jelly, okay? In Japan, people usually have fish, rice, soup, pickles, and green tea. And in Mexico, they usually have eggs, beans, tortillas, or tortillas. If you want to, <coughs> sorry, if you want to pronounce the same way we pronounce in Spanish, I think there's not a problem because tortillas is a word in Spanish. Fresh fruit sweet bread they usually translate it literally because this is pastry like a piece of bread a kind of a dessert that is not salty that is now white bread it's just sweet coffee with milk yes and there are some questions do you have what do you have for breakfast what do you usually have for breakfast check the foods and what else do you have for breakfast i think our case is very similar to mexico because we're very close and we tend to kind of imitate the culture as well probably um some cases a little bit of the us for instance the orange juice or the bacon the eggs they are repeated but in Japan, they don't have eggs for breakfast. They don't have beans. They don't have fruit. They just have fish, rice, pickles, and green tea. All right. Now, I'm going to give you some time. Le voy a dar algunos minutos para que ustedes tomen nota si tienen algo en que escribir. Y digan, uh -huh, what did I have today? ¿Qué, ¿Qué comidas did you have for breakfast? What food did you have for lunch? And what food did you have for dinner today? Van, eso le van a contar a sus partners. For breakfast, I had coffee, bread, eggs. That's an example. Uh, for lunch, I had a soup, beef, tortilla, and juice. And for dinner, I have beans, bread, milk, and banana. This is only an example because in reality, let's see, let's remember what I had for breakfast. I think I had eggs, potatoes, uh, coffee with milk, and a piece of bread, I think. That's what I had. Oh, and fruit. For lunch, yeah, I did have soup, beef soup, a tortilla, some vegetables, and... I think that was it. And for dinner, I had a green salad, egg, avocado, uh, spinach, spinach, yes, I think it was a spinach, and a piece of cheese, and a little bit of soup again. So, are you ready? Mm, as you wish. Not necessarily just short answers. Maybe you can say, I had, for breakfast, I had coffee, bread, cheese, whatever. For lunch, I had blah, blah, blah. For dinner, I had blah, blah, blah. Yes? Any other question? Or it's clear? Yo, yes, tell me. Una pregunta. Yo, por ejemplo, eh, me han hecho una cirugía en la, en la boca y no he comido prácticamente nada todo el día. Solo pongo los líquidos o algo así que tomo. Yes, explain. Exactly. Um, I, I am recovering from a surgery. I didn't have any food. I'm just drinking <laughs> water, juice. <laughs> yes, that's the reality. Okay. Mm -hmm, no problem. Thank you. All right, good. Anybody else? Any other question? Or it's clear. Thumbs up. Okay, cool. So we're going to remake the groups because the groups at the beginning were kind of big. So now we're going to make three. So more people participate in each of the groups. All right, here we go.
No. Hello, good evening. Good evening. Uh, what do you what do you have for breakfast? I had a uh, coffee, bread, eggs, beans, and you? I had a uh, apple pizza with Coca Cola. Mm -hmm. Um, on the lunch. Repeat, please. Es que tengo un poquito de problema con la conexión. And in the lunch. In lunch, I had a soap, beef, and rice, Coca-Cola, <laughs> water. You what? Um, I had rice, bear, top top bear, um, and Coca Cola <laughs> juice. Don't is they. <laughs> I only drink water and juice all the day. Only. That's not. <laughs> That's not. You drink the sorry in the in your mood. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> I'm sorry for you. <laughs> yeah, I'm so sorry. Me too. <laughs> Thank you. Okay. Uh, I I don't I don't drink water. A lot of water in the day. I usually don't drink water. I don't like it. <laughs> I don't like to, but this day is necessary. It's necessary. Yep. So in my breakfast, all the time I was my me I see but me is... no 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 oh, I have I have blah 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 and blah 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 o sea primero la yo en desayuno o sea comí tal cosa esto y lo otro y lo otro okay okay eh bright wrap eh pupusa I have breakfast. Sorry, sorry, sorry. I have pupusas. Eh, chocolate. 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 Eh, sandwich. Eh, eh, huevos, eh, se dice, perdón, eh, eggs. Eh, coffee. Eh, cheese. Eh, ¿Qué es queso de la chist? Ok, y por último, eh, at the flank. lunch, after lunch, flank. No, at the lunch, after lunch, I have what? I have what? No, 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 okay. no, 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 escúchame, te estoy diciendo, comí qué, te dije, no que me digas, I have what, porque ahí me estás preguntando. I have what? Okay. At the lunch, I had. Okay, I had. Okay. Okay. Uh... All right. Did you finish? Hello. Hello. Finished. 
yeah. Okay, what did you have for breakfast? Um, I had egg, egg. Mm -hmm. eggs, Bell. beans, bread, bread, bread. Mm -hmm. and coffee. And coffee. For lunch? For I, I had rice. Rice. And, uh, bell soup. And bean soup. Yeah. Mm -hmm. For dinner? And Coca-Cola. And Coca-Cola. <laughs> and to drink Coca-Cola. <laughs> yeah. Uh -huh. And um, breakfast I had. Uh, For dinner. Uh, excuse me, dinner. Yes. Uh, uh, bean, mm -hmm. bread, bread, and coffee. And coffee, coffee, coffee. with milk. And coffee with milk. That's good. That's great. Yes. Okay. Thanks. You practice. And Miss Flores, Miss Carla Flores, did you practice? Are you not feeling well today? I'm my brain fat. I had um cooked uh, coffee. A cup of coffee. Um uh, two bananas. Two bananas. Uh -huh. Um beans. Beans. Um and cheese. And cheese. All right. For lunch. In my lunch, I have the rice, right? The salad, salad, the salad and tomato, le tomato lechuga. with lettuce. Si. <coughs> All right. Sorry. And you um, still vegetables. And vegetables. Yes, and juice the horchata. Okay. And dinner, um, a soup of chicken. Mm -hmm. Chicken soup. Uh, it's just chicken soup and mm -hmm. vegetables and vegetables and and water and water that's nice yes. great you're very healthy <laughs> y como seguido miss still sick siempre con tos teacher Ay, cuando es, hablo mucho cuando me hablo mucho me da tos Tranquila, don't worry. Este, hay personas que sí le duran, ¿verdad? Los síntomas. Sí, es que ya, ahora me mandaron del trabajo, me dieron otros días para estar acá en casa oh porque muchos estaban tosiendo en el trabajo. Y que también las condiciones de trabajo, ¿verdad? Por el aire acondicionado. Exactly. Sí, yes. y el montón de personas. ¿no? Sí. Impossible. <risa> Oh my goodness, así estamos yes. en el trabajo. Still, solo una persona ha regresado de los cuatro que se habían ido. Oh, no. sí. Pero ese fue justo. Just let's see. Cabal, cuando habíamos llegado como la primera semana. After ah. Christmas vacation. Y hasta hoy ha regresado. Hasta ahora. Sí, sí. yo regresé el lunes. Pero ayer. Uh -huh. Y este. Ahora no, y la me dijeron que no. Sí. Ay, me no. dijeron que no, que me regresara. Sí, es better. Mejor que se recupere realmente. Sí, sí. Ok, sorry to hear that. Sorry, <laughs> I was talking to someone. Here we are again. My goodness. There's a dog, there's a neighbor's dog here that never stops barking. He's impossible, definitely. <laughs> All right. So we already talked about our day and the food that we have consumed during this day but let's listen to these girls talking about their cultures okay so sara and yumiko definitely yumiko is most likely from japan <laughs> okay sara says let's have breakfast together on sunday okay come to my house my family always has a Japanese style breakfast on Sundays. Really? What do you have? 
We usually have fish, rice, and soup. Fish for breakfast, that's interesting. Sometimes we have a salad too, and we always have green tea. Well, I never eat fish for breakfast, but I like to try new things. Okay, so she's inviting her to her house to have breakfast on Sunday. One more time. Let's have breakfast together on Sunday. Okay, come to my house. My family always has a Japanese style breakfast on Sundays. Really? What do you have? We usually have fish, rice, and soup. Fish for breakfast. That's interesting. Sometimes we have a salad too. And we always have green tea. Well, I never eat fish for breakfast, but I like to try new things. All right. Let me see. Let me choose. Okay, once again, I'm going to share the screen because of the names. Hold on. Japanese style. Mm -hmm. Hold on, hold on. Okay. Let's see. Mr. Romero, you want to practice? Yes. Sure. And Mr. Aguirre. Are you ready? Mr. Yeah, I'm Romero. Ready. All right, Mr. Romero, read Sara's part and Mr. Aguirre, Yumiko's part. Go. Let's go. Excuse me. Let's have breakfast together on Sunday. Okay. Come on to my house. My family always has a Japanese style breakfast on Sunday. Really? What do you have? We usually have his rice, fish, rice, and soap. Fish for breakfast? That's interesting. Sometimes we have a salad too, and we always have green tea. Well, I never eat fish for breakfast, but I like to try new things new things awesome good all right mr no well mr Casares, are you ready to practice okay so you are sara and mr lopez mr henry lopez you are jumiko are you ready yes okay go Let's have breakfast together on Sunday. Okay. Come to my house. My family. Okay. Come, come to my house. My family. Everyone. Continue. Okay, come to my house. My family always has. Okay. Has Japanese style breakfast on Sunday. Really? What do you have? Well, sorry. Well, we, we usually uh, have. We have fish, rice. Um, so mm -hmm. fish for breakfast that's interesting sometimes we have salad too and we always and, and we always have every uh, green, tea. Green, tea. green tea okay well i never eat fish for breakfast but I like to try new things. Good. Nice. Now, Melissa is going to be Sarah and Karen is going to be Jumiko. Ready? Yes. One, yes. two, three, go. 
let's have breakfast together on Sunday. Okay, come to my house. My family always has a Japanese style breakfast on Sundays. Really? What do you have? We usually have fish, rice, and soup. Fish for breakfast? That's interesting. Sometimes we have a salad too. And we always have green tea. Well, I never eat fish for breakfast, but I'd like to try new things. Yes. All right. Let's see. Everybody practice. Yes, just Miss Carla, but she's not feeling well. She's been coughing, coughing and coughing. All right. Any question about this conversation? What's interesting about the conversation? Mm -hmm. What's something that you say, oh, that's interesting in that conversation? Tell me. Oh, there's nothing that called your attention? Uh-huh. Not even fish for breakfast on Sundays? <laughs> oh, you usually have fish for breakfast on Sundays? And you green, I mean, and you drink green tea? Teacher. Yes, sir. It, it depends on what is interesting because usually the Japanese food is very rare. For us, but for them it's normal. <laughs> In my personal opinion, I don't like it. I know, that's what I'm saying. Maybe for us it's weird. But for, Jap for Japanese? Some, by the way, sometimes uh, some friends uh, tell me, do you want to try to this food? Yo, uh, what, what happened? No, thank you. <laughs> I, I don't like it. I told them. Actually, they eat a lot of fish. They eat a lot of fish, and the fish is not even cooked. They don't even cook the fish. They, they cut the fish like in very thin slices, and that's how they eat it. For instance, if you eat sushi, it has all the ingredients, of course, but it has raw fish. And that's something very peculiar, let's say, very interesting very strange for us very different very weird so that's what i was saying yes these conversations have some i mean has something different has something interesting the japanese like to have fish for breakfast how teacher, many times have you had fish for breakfast teacher yes the worst thing was it is it throw me exactly wow. It's not cooked. Damn. <laughs> That's what I'm saying. For us, for us oh, as I, Salvadorian, as Latin American, I it's, hate. it's very, very rare. But for them, for Japanese, it's normal, probably. I know. Mm -hmm. But imagine if you have a Japanese friend and he invites you to have breakfast and he serves this food of course you have to say thank you very much it was interesting i like to try new things of course you're not gonna say oh that's terrible why do you have that <laughs> because you want to be nice right you want to be kind with him actually i had a friend from vietnam and she invited me for breakfast and breakfast was before 6 a.m Really? Exactly, and she had this type of uh, Vietnamese food, and it was very different. I, I felt like, oh my God, I need my Salvadorian food. Mm -hmm. <laughs> yes, but I say thank you. I do appreciate it, <laughs> but only one time. I never went back. <laughs> Did you? Yes. On the other hand, I can see to the Salvadorian <laughs> eating eating dog yes lots of things and for them probably our food is not nice for breakfast <laughs> our food is very greasy 
very fat, right? So that depends on the cultures, definitely. Okay, give me one second. Just need to double check something here on the presentation. Yes. All right. Let's see. Oh my God. One second, please. All right. Mm -hmm. I kind of get lost with the presentation. <laughs> okay, you can see the presentation now. All right, what food? I'm gonna click and you have to predict what food do you think is going to come out? Any idea? Say something, cheese, bread, say something. What food? Fish, chicken, garlic. Who was that? Uh, <laughs> soup. <Tacos. laughs> okay, next. Tacos. Tacos. Yeah. Potato. <laughs> next. Predict. Jogger. Right. Rice. Lemon. <laughs> okay. Next. Spaghetti. Next. Pizza. Pizza. Uh, jelly. <laughs> Next. Apples. Apples. Carrots. Next. Lettuce. Lettuce. Egg. <laughs> A very heavy egg. <laughs> okay. Next. Tomatoes. 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 Yes. Sugar. <laughs> Next. Yeah. Dings. Bread. Somebody says bread at the beginning. I remember. Is there any other? Uh -huh. Lettuce. Somebody says lettuce. Oh, tomato. Somebody said tomato before. And butter. Butter, of course. Okay. This is just to have an idea, but um, how many food do you remember? Okay, so I have some of these three sentences about today's class. Escriban tres oraciones al menos en el chat de la clase de este día. Whatever you want to say on the chat, okay? I'm going to be reading your comments. Tres ideas, three simple ideas. If you think three is too many, write one or two, at least. But say something. Uh -huh. We practice a conversation about a Chinese breakfast. <laughs> we review the use of some and any. My partners were practicing a lot in their rooms. I didn't remember the vocabulary about food. <laughs> the use of any and some, that's right. Uh huh. What else? Mm -hmm. Long answers, short answers. Oh no, that was a question before. <laughs> okay. Uh huh. We describe what we had, what we had for breakfast, lunch, and dinner. What else? What else? What else? Only one comment. No, that's not possible. You need to write more. There was, okay, different foods in vocabulary. Good. What else? What else? What else? My partners were very tired. <laughs> no, no, that one. Regarding the, the, the class, actually. Oh, yeah, I used the questions. Okay, what you ate today? Mm -hmm. What foods do you have for breakfast, lunch, and dinner? That's right. Okay, what else? Describe different type of food in different countries. That's good. 
Yes, that's a good one. All right. No more? No more, no more, no more. Okay. I hope you saved the website I provided you so that you can keep practicing. You can find lots of, lots of different exercises there. So great having you here tonight. Is there any question, any comment? Anything else you want to add? No? I have a question, teacher. Yes, sir. Go ahead. First of all, I like your earrings. <laughs> My coconut ah, earrings. <laughs> really? For real. They are big. Okay. Okay. Uh, let's see. Este, la plataforma con solo una que no haya completado uno, no lo deja pasar a, la, a terminarla. No lo deja avanzar. ¿Por un ejercicio sí. o por una, por un, digamos, sí. una pregunta? Digamos por una pregunta. Si tengo cinco y solo respondí cuatro, uh -huh. al final no me va a dejar terminarlo. Uh -huh. Tiene que estar al 100 todo. Ok. Y en, en este caso, o sea, me surge la duda porque I'm, I'm kind of new too. Me surge la duda. En este caso, déjenme ver. I'm gonna, vamos a pausar aquí el recording. So... Have a good night. Take care. See you tomorrow. You. Bye. Sleep well.